at you. Oh, 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 look at my husband. Ooh. <laughs> Looking like a chocolate snack. <laughs> you better know it. <laughs> what kind of snack am I? <laughs> Ooh, wow, uh, you are looking like a smoked gouda on a trisket. <laughs> you better know it! <laughs> Excuse me? Uh, not you, babe. No. Oh. You know, you welcome to the block, welcome to the neighborhood, welcome to the hood. Thank you so much for getting Grover a ticket. You know, we played Tony Braxton for him in utero. It is so perfect that this is gonna be his first concert. He is so excited. <laughs> well, damn, he doesn't look excited. <laughs> he looks like he's ready for bed. Grover, come on. You're gonna love it. This is the music you grew up on. I like her music, I just... Don't want to go to my first concert with a, a, a bunch of old people. Who are you calling to know? Hey, you know what? No, I'll give them a reason to go to bed. Calvin! I mean, you think she can hold it? Mama! <laughs> You're watching Nickelodeon. Keep it here. With the blip blip. Skirt! Skirt! Trey, 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 Trey. We gotta go. We gotta go, man. Oh, that, that was quick. I well, still charge y'all for four hours. No, Courtney's water just broke. Oh, hell no. Because y'all family, I'm gonna give you a discount on the cleaning fee. Oh! Contraction. Okay, let's get her to a hospital. Oh, I'm sorry, we blocked in. See that van right in front of us? That's Tony's, and she busy for a while. <laughs> oh, Trey, I told you we couldn't park here. Guys, I'm trying to call the doctor. Does anybody have a signal down here? No. no. I cannot believe this is happening. You know what? It's going to be fine. I'm missing Tony Braxton. I mean, <laughs> can you hear that? I'm pretty sure that's the bass from He Wasn't Man Enough. <laughs> it's my jam. Hey, Malcolm. Yeah, proud of you, boy. Thank you. <laughs> you took your shot at Tony Braxton. <laughs> now, you missed? I missed. But, but you shot, though. Yeah. Don't move. No, seriously. Be right back. She is so beautiful. I could hold her forever. You have been. Yeah, gimme, give gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give okay, okay. Oh, the water, the water, the water, the water, the water, the water. Guys, 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 full words, please. We've made the choice not to use baby talk. To dump to a baby? Well, the studies show that it can delay a child's language skills. <laughs> yeah, y'all gonna be fun parents. So, the doctor says that you can go home tomorrow. Are you ready? I'm so ready. Hmm. Okay, you have got to teach me that, Dad. <laughs> well, don't worry. No one's ever really ready. We'll all figure this out. It takes a village. Hey, guys, I, I, I'm so sorry. Have we discussed godparents yet? <laughs> I mean, look, no, no pressure, but you know, I did miss the concert and paid for the van that she was born in, not to mention the very expensive concert t-shirts, which, by the way, are a total loss. But, uh... You hear that voice, that annoying voice? That's your Uncle Dave. Get used to it. It never stops. <laughs> the doctor's office. And just being here is making my glands swell. Feel them. No. You gotta stop with this anxiety. I mean, where does it come from? Enough is enough. 
It's really nice having Grammy here, isn't it? Uh-huh. <laughs> of course I'm here. I wouldn't let my Maxine go to the doctor alone. <clears throat> Cover your mouth around my baby. <sighs> How are you feeling, Maxine? Remember, all emotions are valid. I'm okay. Because Grammy's here? And you're tough like your best friend Grammy. What's the forehead of a nine-year-old? <laughs>boss man ah, I have money for you I never get tired of hearing that <laughs> you know what this is the final payment I owe you for max dot hence the boss man I heard it and I like it <laughs> oh. fellas for oh, he's the owner of max dot for he's the owner of max dot for he's the owner of max dot Goodwin had a big deal, and I realized the owner of Max Dot today. Order up! Yes, I have ears! Which she will hold on to tonight. <laughs>
My coach says if I get another bad grade, he's gonna bench me. I can only imagine what you're going through. Thanks, man. Because I... I've gotten straight A's my whole life, so I can only imagine. Coach has a Marty on thick. We got the same grade? We got the same grade! We're brain twins. Up top. Ah, that's my favorite head of the Harvard Psychology Department. Oh, I recognize that buttery tone. Fraser wants something from you. Most likely feedback from the memoir he's penning. <laughs> Nonsense. And how could you read my entire life saga and have your only note be, Moore Allen? <laughs> no, no, you're misquoting me entirely. My note was Les Frazier. How can I help you, Dr. Frank? Yes, um, exactly. Um, please, come and sit. It's this whole Dr. Crane business, you see? It sounds a bit clunky, doesn't it? No. Professor Crane. That is a certain je ne sais quoi. <laughs> oh, I say exactly quoi. <laughs> the title of professor connotes status. Yes, but it's more than status. It also connotes legitimacy. <laughs> Quite the gesture. Wow, Dad, it smells great in here. What you making? Pastries. Oh, did you uh, close the door? There are bees in the vestibule. Oh, yeah. Oh, sorry about that. I got to get my landlord on that. Get on that. <laughs> Why are you making pastries? Well, I've embarrassed myself twice with Provost Sharma in my attempts to get a professorship. So you're being responsible, cutting your losses, and trying again next year. I'm kidding. Of course, please tell me your stupid plan. <laughs> I've made his favorite, homemade honey buns which will pair perfectly with the rousing speech I prepared for the review board. Oh, you're making honey buns. And I called the plan stupid. <laughs> so don't let these little setbacks throw you. That's good advice. Good, because I got to give my dad the same speech when he's done sleeping off the drugs and shame. <laughs> you know, you may just be the smartest crane of all. Too bad you only show it when you're drunk. Yeah. You know, I did kind of enjoy exercising my intellectual side with that paper of yours. Well, I am supposed to be writing an essay on Proust. <laughs> uh, Why? Well, I, I guess I could, uh, you know, take a look at your notes or whatever. Okay, so, think about water. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Are you sure this is the right house? I thought you said you were a firefighter. Uh, I am. Yeah. They uh, they let you stay here when you're firefighter of the month. <laughs> Come on. How do you afford all this? Sorry, couldn't hear you. I'm already halfway up the stairs. Oh my God! Is this Baldacci Cabernet? This costs more than I make in a week. <laughs> Should we drink it? Uh, you know, it's it's more of a, a looking wine. Oh come on. Let's live a little. Yeah, I can't. Uh, most of this stuff is actually my dad. You got me into this button fly. You're gonna have to get me out. Okay, I'm gonna go. Yeah. Don't move. No, seriously. Be right back. Hey, Dad. Oh, Freddie, thank God you're here. I can't figure out how to make this damn phone work. You having fun? More fun than I had at the market. It took me forever because I was afraid to go top speed on my rascal scooter. I'm sorry, all right? It's just, you have no idea how hard it is to explain to a woman I'm a grown man living with my dad. Right. Couldn't possibly imagine what that's like. That's different. 
when Grandpa moved in with you, it was your place, you were helping him out. Now, it's also your place, but you won't let me do anything to help out around here. I mean, you pay the bills, you, you cook half my meals. Which I am happy to do, you're my son. But I'm also an adult. I spent a long time on my own. I'm used to pulling my own weight. I don't need you stalking the- Oh, my back. Oh, my hip. Oh, my knee. Oh. Are you okay? I can pretend to be a doctor. You're watching Nickelodeon. Keep it here. Oh. <sighs> Thank you. Yeah. Oh, it's my knee. An old polo injury. Well, water or horse? Neither. I slipped trying on a pair of chinos at the Ralph Lauren store. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, no problem. Ready? Professor? <laughs> hey, Dad, I'm just gonna, uh... Did you hurt your leg? Oh. Uh, no, 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 it's fine. Well, so I, I gotta go, but... Do you think maybe you want to grab a drink this weekend? Sure. Yeah, I'd love that. <laughs> okay, cool. <laughs> um, you have a wonderful son! <laughs> yes, I know. Thank you. Oh, excuse me. I'm sorry. I've got to take this. Yes, Mr. President? <laughs> Okay, I think she's great, but I'm not doing this forever. 